how do you know that you have become a master with any new skill that you are trying to develop in your life? Any one of us, when we develop a new skill, goes through the same four stages of development until you reach that mastery level. The first level, whenever you learn a new skill, is known as the unconscious incompetence level. Unconscious incompetence level. Another way of saying it is, I don't know what I don't know. I train schedulers who schedule hospital staff and when they sit in my classroom the very first day they know that they are going to schedule hospital staff but they have never seen the software that we use they've never seen the telephone system that we use so they don't know yet what they don't know and then when I start the training then I introduce them to the software I introduce them to our telephone system I introduce them to the processes and then they move into the next level of learning and development and it's known as the conscious incompetence level it simply means now I know what I don't know I know now what I need to learn now it's very easy to think knowing is doing but no <laughs> just knowing what you don't know is not going to get you to do what you need to do so now these schedulers need to get their hands dirty and they actually need to start to work in the system they not to need to start to work with the telephone system and generally when you move in that phase they, you then move into what's known as the conscious competence level conscious competence simply means that I can do the work but I can't do it on autopilot I have to think about it in the classroom they have a guide me that they use they have um, you know other instructional material that they use and even if they start to work without those guide me's they have to think about where do I click where do I click before they can actually do the work it's known as the conscious competence level. Eventually, you will reach a level that's known as the unconscious competence level. And what that simply means is you can do the work on autopilot. You don't even have to think about it. Most of you that probably watch this video drive a vehicle. When you started the first time to drive a vehicle, you had to think about all the things that you had to do. You noticed every road sign. You had to think about where do I put on the indicator? Where do I shift the gears and that kind of stuff? Now you can probably drive home and then when you get home, you don't even know how you got home because you did everything unconsciously. So you've developed an unconscious competence level. And that is when you know that you have become a master. So with any skill that you are developing, what you want to do is you want to get to a level where you are absolutely a master with even knowing it. When I started to make these videos, one of the struggles that I had was to look at the little camera lens. Now I'm getting better and better at it. Sometimes I'm unconsciously competent in knowing exactly where I need to look. Other times I'm still consciously competent. So you might have noticed in the beginning, I looked at the lens, I looked at the camera, and then I looked at the lens and I remembered, oh, I need to go there. So that tells me I have not quite reached the mastery level yet of speaking on camera and knowing where I need to look. Okay? So that is how you become a master of anything that you are learning. It is when you reach that unconscious competence level and you can do it without even thinking about it.